it's me again. A couple of weeks ago there was a day, a special day. A day as my reliable calendar reliably told me when we were supposed to keep the TV off all day. See? No TV, all day. Nichts, nada, niente, nothing. Handily for me, I don't watch an awful lot of telly at the moment. Not necessarily through choice, I'm just not physically in a place where there is a TV for me to watch for the majority of hours that I'm awake. If I were at home more, I would absolutely be watching more telly. It's an excellent invention, created by the Romans, obviously, but that's a different story for another time. Anyway, we're going off piste. I feel bad for missing Keep the TV Off Day and I reckon that as a species it would be good for us to every once in a while have our own private Keep the TV Off Days. And for any brave soul out there who wants to give this a go, I've thought of some alternative activities that we can do if we're finding it a little tricky to step away from the goggle box. Which reminds me, that's back on for a new series soon. Okay, maybe I watch more TV than I realise. not finally put all those hours you spent watching cookery programs to good use and actually try to cook something. Bonus points if you manage to use Samphire. Seriously, what the hell is Samphire and is MasterChef sponsored by it? I'm not even sure I'm saying it right. It could be Samphire, it could be Sandfire for all I know. Have a go at writing a new song. <laughs> oh, that nearly went through the window. Oh, Telly, you're my rectangle best friend. Oh, Telly, when will this day end? Telly, why did I give you up? You've always been so good to me, why did I turn you off? Why? Exercise! One! Two! Three, you get the point. Pretend that you're on telly hosting your own show. Hi there and welcome back. Today in the studio we're talking to John, who says that ever since he was hit over the head by a rather stale baguette, he can't stop talking in French. Hello John, or should we say bonjour. Strictly speaking, I'm not sure that that one stays true to the meaning of keep the TV off day, but remember, you're not actually on telly, you're just a moron pretending. That live studio audience you're filming in front of? It's just a group of teddy bears. Develop your own creativity by writing a poem. T is for telly, you watch all day long. E is for Emmerdale's well-known theme song. L is for lounging on the sofa all day. E is for every time the remote's too far away. V is for v talk to another human. In my case, the role of another human will be played by me because currently there are no other humans available for me to talk to. Hey, how are you? Yeah, not bad, thanks. You? Yeah, pretty good, thanks. What have you been up to lately? Ah, uh, you know, this and that. Uh, I'm actually making a video at the moment. Oh, really? What's it about? Well, it's about how we shouldn't be watching so much TV. Oh, that sounds interesting. Yeah, yeah, I'm actually spending the whole day not watching any TV at all. I couldn't do that. Not on a Bake Off day. Bake Off's on tonight. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hi again, my name is Rebecca and I post a new video every Wednesday. The same day as Bake Off. So it's nice and easy to remember. So when you settle down to watch Paul and Mary, you should think, ah, I haven't watched Becky's new video. I should go and do this after I've seen who gets Star Baker this week. It should be Tamal, really. I mean, he deserves it of all the ones who haven't had it yet. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back next week. In the meantime, remember to work hard, laugh harder, and always accept a hug. Bye-bye.